Good Saturday morning, everybody. It is I, Trevor Thompson, the self-appointed Looney Tunes critic. It is the first Saturday of the month. That means, you know what that means. It means it's guest time. And this is one of the cartoons from the Hunter trilogy. So for those of you who have been paying attention, that means only one thing. The guest is the one, the only, the great Looney Tunes comic artist and and uh, amazing Chuck Jones fan. And also, just for the record, amazing puppeteer Dave Alvarez. Dave, oh. how you doing? And he coughs right in the mic. That's his intro. Thank you, Dave. <laughs> you're, you're despicable. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, how are you doing? Pretty good, man. Thanks for coming back. Um, yeah. You're a busy dude, man. Busier than a one-legged man in an ass-kicking contest, I dare say. <laughs> <laughs> I need now, to use the reference. You should. Um, please uh, please take my jokes that I've stolen from other people. Oh, well, so, nice. yeah. I, 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 I do that too. So Yeah. Well, it's fair. They all do, even even Chuck. Even Chuck, yeah. Frizz, is, stole- Frizz is the worst, but, you know, uh, for that. But Chuck, Chuck definitely does. In this case, I guess you could say Chuck uh, steals from himself. Yeah. Because he's kind of doing the... It's a weird thing. I've, I've always, I always felt like as good as this cartoon is, it's kind of a cheater because it's just, it's new gags. But you know, like the 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 attempt of putting the the idea of putting it in a snow tundra just is mm. like, well, we need to make it somewhat different. So it's like, really? Do you really need to? I mean, there's how many Roadrunner cartoons set in the desert, you know, and and no one yeah. bats an eye. It's like I don't know that. But you know, it's yeah, it's, an, it's, it's an opportunity to see some snow and some wonderful Maurice noble layouts. <laughs> Maybe they call, they call Maurice and said, "You know, we're gonna do a turk cartoon." Oh, I'm tired of those backgrounds. I don't have to do the forest again. No, 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 no. You you get to do snow now. Yeah, a lot of negative space actually. <laughs> Yeah, I love negative space. <laughs> You'll be good. In fact, you don't even need to paint the paper. <laughs> yeah. Just, just leave, leave it, it white. Leave it white. Leave it white. <laughs> there's, leave a, it white. Th- there's a joke in here that I always thought was funny, and I still, I don't know why, but it's when it's when Daffy goes over to Elmer here, and he starts to read it. And in fact, I'll just let you, him say it. Hurry up, hurry up. The fine print doesn't mean a thing. <laughs> <laughs> That's the joke. I love the idea. I love the idea that Daffy hand wrote a fricasseeing license, and, <laughs> and, put, and he probably didn't. But he, the idea of him making fine print, you know, <laughs> hitherto up like legal speak in the bottom, hitherto unknown at this point. Now, whether I just yeah, I don't know why. I love the idea of that. It was, it was nice. That was, that's a that's a good one. <laughs> Now this is the this is a cartoon I remember. Um, uh, a lot of the the Clampett uh, enthusiasts, uh, or even the uh, Chris Felucci enthusiasts, would say, you know, this is where it becomes divisive, and Bugs Bunny isn't really doing anything; he's just kind of holding up signs. Mm-hmm. And honestly, <clears throat> I don't know that I agree with that, only because Daffy is so beside himself in these cartoons that. And the weird thing is, is that Bugs is only doing this, this relaxed, holding up signs thing in the third cartoon, which in a way kind mm-hmm. of makes one feel like, well, even even Bugs is like, you know what? I know how to handle this shit. I don't even. Need yeah, to, yeah, I don't even need. You to, know, I've been through this before, you know. <laughs> I don't even need to fully get out of the hole. His legs yeah. are still in the hole half the time. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's, it's now that you mentioned that, it's funny because uh, when I was making working on the comics. I uh, try to bring, you know, those elements from, from animation to the comics. And um, one of the things that I did, uh, and it wasn't one of the stories, I, I can't remember which, which one. I kept Box in the same position in six frames, as Daffy was, you know, having a ride on the, on the, on the yeah. other side. And I remember the editor saying, you're shitting. Bugs Bunny's not moving, Giannis. So that's the idea. <laughs> yeah, that's the point. <laughs> that's the point. You know, he's like, you know, I, I don't care what you do. I, I'm just cool here. Yeah. And she's like, oh, you're right. Damn you. <laughs> Damn you. <laughs> well, that's good. At least she, she, uh, because it makes you wonder. It's like, well, have you never seen these cartoons? It's like, that's exactly what Bugs would do is, is kind of sit there. The more, the more it's, it's, it's the dyna, the dynamics of their relationship, the, the angrier and more 
outlandish Daffy gets, the calmer Bugs gets. Mm-hmm, you know? yeah, that, it wouldn't make sense if he tried to match him. Of course. <laughs> it, it, that's something that I, I always uh, criticize and when, when, when I saw their stories. They, they tried to move everything in the, in the comics. You know? they, they, they didn't dare to act. And I, think I need you need to act. You need yeah. to, to to make this believable, and that's the wonderful thing of these cartoons. You know, everybody's acting and it is, it's doing it fine. But yes. now but I have it, to I have to admit I I'm not a comic book guy, so I don't I don't read the comics. But do they mm-hmm. do they consider these cartoons to be canon or continuity, or is it more like this where it's different every time for every story? Well, on a funny note. I don't read comics either. Yeah. <laughs> I, I entered into the comics because I, I want to. I wanted to join animation, but I didn't have the resources to get there. Right. So my way of getting into the industry was through these comics. So if I read by that time, I just read uh, Carl Bulk's comics of the Scrooge comics and yeah. Donald Duck comics. I, I wasn't really into. I, I don't know what the hell is going on in Batman's world. <laughs> so, <laughs> but. Uh, yeah, when when we started working on these comics, these cartoons were like you know the the essence of everything that that, that they were doing. They didn't know much about Clampet area, although I cheated and used Bugs Bunny Clampet uh, a few times. And here I am talking again, and the cartoon is over. <laughs> Just like Pez. <laughs> Just like Pez again. 